So we headed to LA and we flying out of Austin. So we had to, we wanted to stop and grab something to eat really quick. We end up coming to the Buzz Meal, which has a uh, damn plow burger. They have Mission Street Burrito. And then they even have something else on the backside. We'll get that later. But I think all of these places, I believe, are vegan. Uh, so, so the other truck over here is actually Plow Bow, as you can see. So they have uh, plant-based bow buns. And truth be told, I've never, ever had one. So it's not they didn't have bow buns that day, but we ended up getting some cheese rangoons, and they were really, really good. So make sure to give them a follow and check out their menu and their schedule. That was just a sneaky snack. A sneaky snack? A sneaky snack. I need eight more of them ragoons. They were good. They taste no different from the real thing. They were good. Eight dollars. No, they, they no were. different from Panda Express, any hole in the wall Chinese spot. I haven't had them at Panda Express. You haven't had them? Mm -mm. They were good. Well, cheese ragoons take the, taste the same everywhere. But they, those might be better than what the ones that I've tasted. You know? They. So now we're checking out Plow Burger and we Plow got burger. a breakfast burger. I think it has like Beyond you like breakfast. That's Meat. Oh, of course I do. Like it has Beyond Meat, Just Egg, and I think some type of Chipotle sauce, hash brown. Ooh. This looks like a standard breakfast sandwich that's like vegan breakfast sandwich. They usually, it's pretty much breakfast on a bun. You, you know what I'm saying? Sauces. You got the hash brown, you got the sauce, you got the Just Egg, you got the cheese, you got the Beyond Meat. It's looking pretty good. And we also got a six piece nugget. I've never had the alpha nugget, so I just got them because I've never had them Ooh, before. They got a, they snick a little. That huh. actually, that's a little more than a six there. piece. How much <laughs> they charge us for? I don't know. That's more than a six piece. And they put a fry in there. This is more than six. Maybe he charges three, for Three, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm not, I'm not going to complain. Because there's only a six and a, a nine. A nine, nine piece. Wow. Oh, so they blessed us. Us. So, huh? You want to do the honors? Oh yeah. Oh, you know I like to dip stuff in sauce. We got two you know sauces. what? Not, see, I gotta eat stuff before, as a respect to the food. I gotta try it before with before but the sauce. But if you know you like sauce, you know you like sauce. Man, what kind of sauce is this? So you can enjoy it. I think that's ranch, and it has a, it has a little. Chipotle I like sauce to try on. people's house sauces, like the sauces they created. They probably created the ranch. Vegan ranch is not normal. That's true, but I like I like some of the little color. Well, I have a bit of is it would you compare it to anything like Earth Burgers breakfast sandwich? Yeah, I like or... the Earth Burger breakfast sandwich. Only this, yeah, I like the Earth Burger breakfast sandwich. It's not only the bagel. The only difference is they have a bagel, and there's probably a little more saucy. Fire, right? Fire. Crispy. Right here. Let me get some of that hash brown. They cool. I don't usually like egg on a sandwich. You don't? At the Earth Burger, I don't know why. Okay, now here's the hard part. But the hot brown. You ready for the hot? Is this part? a burger or a sausage? I thought it said patty, so I'm thinking it was a burger, but it don't look like a burger. You know? Yeah, it looks real thin, but it's good. No, nah, it, because it's probably operating as a sauce. Do Either you think way, that that's the same sauce? That's the same sauce? No, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, this is good. It's good. Okay, here's the hard mm -hmm. part. You ready? Mm-hmm. Rating the crab rangoons first, because that's what we had first. Oh, that's a 10. It's a 10 for you? That's a 10 for me. It's a 10? That's a 10 for me. 
and raccoons are a 10. What are you going to say? Because if it's less than a 10, we got to go get some more. No. <laughs> I feel like this is our first time rating something. So it's like, I want to leave some room. And we've had a lot of plant-based options. Flavor profile, texture, taste. Texture, 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. Now, it's not expensive, but I will say you pay eight dollars for four little You're right. crab rangoons. You're right. But and usually when you at, get a ragoon some, at a, like a Chinese, they're like a little bit bigger. But as somebody who buys vegan groceries, I do get it. Mm -hmm. And I will say I would gladly spend my eight dollars to order mm -hmm. four more of those. So it's that good. All right. Yeah. So I'm just I'm gonna go nine point five. I'm gonna give myself a little leeway and say nine point five. But they they're they're freaking awesome. All right, freaking awesome. Um. Uh, the breakfast sandwich. You know what I mean. What do you think about the breakfast this sandwich? Good. What do you think about the breakfast sandwich? Compared to other breakfast sandwiches that I've had, this is better. You like that one? I like this better. The bun's not too much. The patty's not overwhelming. Other than other than I thought it was gonna be like a burger burger. Yeah. I mean, it's a burger burger, but everything kind of overwhelms the patty. You know what I mean? No, I taste it. I, mean, I taste the patty, but you know, it's, it's still has the egg, it still has the cheese, mm -hmm. the hash brown. Yeah. It's really everything goes together for me. Yeah. yeah. Good. Sorry, I you know, I eat, my, eat my breakfast, I'll get a piece of bread and put everything on there and then you make a sandwich. It's almost the same. <laughs> one one know, out I of ten. Dip it in the sauce. One out of ten for the one sandwich. out of ten. Yeah. It's better than any breakfast. Burger. Uh, we would have to get that in her burger. I think her burger is close. It's probably been a while since you had it. You've not. You haven't had it fresh. No, I've, I've had it. I had it fresh. When is the last time you had it? The first time we had it. It's been. I a had while, it fresh, though. but then I Uber. And it was cold. It, it was cold, and the bread was very hard. hard. Mm -hmm. I was like, this ain't. This ain't it. I think they're very comparable to each other. They're very close. Because I'm usually not a fan of bagels but their bagels are really soft when they come up i prefer fresh. the bun over the bagel they really, Fire, right? really the same in my opinion yeah but plow mm. burger all together it's it one out of ten what a sandwich one out of ten i get that sandwich a 9.5 a 9.5 it's it's giving me it's better. This is this is about as good as it gets. It's way it's better than, and I'm I don't. Wanna, I don't want to compare. I don't want to talk, I don't I don't talk, talk down, down on right, anybody. Right, right. But it's all preference. Yeah. It's real good. I love breakfast. And my preference is that right there. Right. That's really good. It's really good. I'm telling you. And maybe it was just fresh. I don't know. The herb breaker one is very similar. But we can't get it. Two no different more. breads, two different breads, two different sauces. True about that, but they're very close. We can't get it no more, so I can't argue with you because they don't it sell no it more. no more. They have it in a wrap. Oh yeah. They don't have it in the thing anymore. Mm. But I was, it for me, it tastes the same. But these nuggets, let's compare these nuggets. I really, mm, these nuggets are it. These are the best. Like I haven't had really good. It's the crispiness for me. It's really, they're really, 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 really crispy. Don't make that contact. <laughs> oh well. Um, <laughs> I would say these are these are cool. Ranking them wise, for me, the Morning Star Nuggets are are the best nuggets that I've had. Morning Star? The Morning Star Nuggets. Morning Star. Yes, the one Leslie eats. <laughs> Morning Star. Yes, the Morning Star Nuggets. The regular ones are vegan and the Buffalo ones are vegan. They have they have like a the reason they're good to me is because they have like a child like uh taste like chicken nuggets. Something's a little different with these. I like the this. texture is cool. The texture is amazing. The flavor profile is not quite there for me. I like the flavor. It's not too overpowering. It's not too, I don't want to say too seasoned because, you know. It ain't seasoned. That's what it is. But it's still crispy. It's crispy. And it, I like it. I know why. Because it's not seasoned. Because it's not seasoned. 
I don't think it has to be seasoned. It's still a great nugget. If you eat chicken with no salt. These are nuggets though. We're not comparing chicken thighs and breasts. We're comparing chicken nuggets. And these are the good these are good chicken nuggets. The Guardian ones. I mean the Morning Star ones are better. I haven't I haven't had the Morning Star, so but I've had the Nashville. We're not comparing so no, I, no. I'm not talking about and those. The Guardian outer nuggets. layer is so hot. She's a rookie, so we can't even we can't Oh, even, we can't oh even. now I'm a rookie. <laughs> now I'm a rookie. I've been doing this. You can't talk about nuggets if you haven't had the morning star. Okay, well, we'll try the morning star. No, we won't. When we we do it. <laughs> this is it. It's too late. It's going to be as close as you can. <laughs> we'll try the morning star. Maybe there's a little, a little something to it. The sauce is cool, too. I like the, I like the sauce. But if I came here again, I'd get the breakfast sandwich over this. Yeah, but those aren't bad. I want to try the cheese fries. I'm going to need some hot sauce or something. This sauce don't really do it for the nuggets for me. The sauce just, it's just missing like a little salt, a little something, just a little garlic Everything powder. Everything can't have a kick. You don't have to have a kick, you mm. just got to have some flavor. The ranch, try the ranch, try the ranch. Try the ranch. I mean, these are alpha It's not nuggets, giving though. me ranch, it's giving me more gravy. Right? That's better. It's giving like a more gravy taste. Fire though. The sandwich. Fire. I bet all their other sandwiches great. Now the next time, anytime that you go out with your significant other, <laughs> make sure you split the food in half before you start eating. So you said I ate half of this burger? <laughs> you ate more than half of that burger. No, I ate mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. So anyway, it's hard for me to give a rating on a sandwich, but I'ma say How is it hard for you to give a rating? If if I can if I can finish then I can I can tell you mm. because it's hard giving ratings on stuff. I'm a, but I'm gonna say I'm a, I'm gonna give it I'm gonna give it a ten. Yeah. I'm gonna give it a ten. Yeah. I'm not going. Yeah, it's it's probably it deserves a ten. Probably the best you know mm -hmm. breakfast sandwich I've had. Um, the nuggets for me, they they like a they knocking on a seven. You know what I'm saying? You're an eight for me. Seven. But they're 8. good. 5, I would get them again. I might do a different sauce. Me, I probably would get a buffalo sauce or something like that. But they're not bad at all. The texture is way better than the Gardein tenders and stuff, though. But oh, yeah. if I'm going to compare, I'm going to say the Morning Star has the texture and the flavor on point first. Mm -hmm. But not all of this stuff are vegan. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we out. Y'all probably see us again in Cali eating some of their food. Or something. Oh so. yeah. I'm so excited to try. First of all, Austin has way more. I mm -hmm. think we tried every option in San Antonio. There's always some popping up. We've missed some stuff. But I'm excited to try Austin options, which you know we're trying, and definitely California options. Oh, Kelly gonna go crazy. Okay. But this was all great. Do we have some more nights? Yo, yo, yo. Hey, thank you so much for tuning in, family. All right, this is our first video we've done in a while, but we went out to Austin on the way to LAX, well, to the airport to go to LAX, and we stopped at the Buzz Mill, and we had Plow Bow and uh, Plow Burger. Uh, food was great. Uh, but let us know what you think, all right? Drop down in the description if you want us to make more videos like this, or, you know, you wanted me to do some other things. But I got some other videos coming up to be about uh, some food we ate when we was in Los Angeles. We went back to Austin to eat some more food. Oh man, that's a good one. That's a really good one. And of course, we got some places here in the San Antonio, Texas area. And of course, some things that I do around the house daily when I'm hungry, stuff like that. So stay tuned. Make sure to, you know, comment what you want to see us do. Uh, follow me on Instagram at Plant Based Mellow. I post on there more frequently, but I'll be posting on YouTube. All right. So I'll see y'all soon. Peace. I got green juice.